Hello, and welcome to Spirit Forest. If you're not used to my channel, usually I'm not in my backyard. I'm up in the mountains and I'm hiking and backpacking and camping. And I'm not kidding you, I camp between 60 to 70 days a year. Maybe not this year, uh, but most years I've camped 60 to 70 days a year. So, and it's all been in the same sleeping bag. And I'm probably gonna gross you out, but uh, I have never washed my sleeping bags before. I am going to bring it out. This is a down sleeping bag. And the reason why I haven't watched, washed any of my down sleeping bags because I'm just scared that something's going to happen to them. So here we go. This is my oldest sleeping bag. This sleeping bag I have had, oh, it might have been like in college, one of my first sleeping bags <laughs> that I actually bought that was really worth something. Um, I did buy some of those cheap ones and then I learned that you need to buy a down sleeping bag here in Colorado to keep you warm. Um, so it is really compacted, um, but it's also very dirty as well. Like there's like ring around the collar type. <laughs> it's so, so nasty, yes. So I am going to wash this and I feel this is an EMS. This used to be the brand that I would only shop at when my best friends, he worked there. Anyways, side note. Um, no, the baby crying. Oh, poor baby. Okay, so this is really old. It's really kind of compact right now. It's really dirty, never been washed. And when I say I had it in college, let's see, I'm 46 now. I went to college in my early 20s. Yeah, it's really old sleeping bag. I was gonna do my, um, my nicer one, my kind of newer one, but I'm like, let's just wait. Let's just see what, this, what happens to the sleeping bag. And that's what we're gonna do today. I am going to wash this. I got this new product and I'm not being sponsored by them or anything like that, but I did get this like new product. No idea if it works or not, but we're gonna try it out. Um, let's read and find out. Yeah, I, I am 46. I can't, I can't see everything anymore. <laughs> I need these. As of like last year, I need these. Okay, you can wash with sleeping bags, very large jackets. Uh, I think it's just for down, um, for regular down gear. Let's see. We got to immerse the item. We got to find the tag. Oh, the tag. There's no way. Like, look how old this is. It's already washed out. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to read the washing instructions. So, anyways, we are just going to follow the instructions on here. And that is to use a front loading washing machine, um, place a, a maximum of two items in the washing machine and add 3.4 ounces. You know, it'd be nice if they gave you a cup that you could fill. I don't know what 3.4 ounces would be. We're gonna guess on that. Okay, what else we got? Wash according to care label. Yep, can't read that. And then spin dry three times slow spin. Okay, we're not at the dry yet. Oh, we're only at the wash at this point. So, are you excited? I'm nervous. I'm really nervous. That's why I'm gonna use this sleeping bag because if I'm gonna get rid of any sleeping bag, it would be this one, not my, my true precious. <laughs> okay, let's go down to the laundry room and get this started.
well the sun's setting so I wanted to get it out of the dryer you can see it's still a little wet here just a little wet I had it going um, twice I put it on twice I think it was a total of like 30 to 40 minutes something like that um, I know you gotta remember this is a really old sleeping bag I think it worked out pretty well. Like it's not ripped or anything, and that's what I was concerned about. Um, I'm just gonna hang it out to dry because it's still a little, still a little damp in some spots. It's gonna hang it out to dry a little bit more, but I think it worked out pretty well. I think I'm gonna use it for my my precious sleeping bag. So if you're scared to wash your sleeping bag, don't be scared because. It works. <laughs> now again, I don't know what kind of washer you have, and you need to have a front-loading washer, but you could use, um, you could do it by hand as well. And I was trying to record as much as I possibly could without boring you, because <laughs> it is just doing laundry. We're doing laundry together. That's what we're doing. <laughs> okay, I hope I can get in the mountains soon and get you some mountain videos, because there's only so much I could do here in the city. <laughs> <laughs> and we're doing laundry. <laughs> I want to thank you for, for joining me on this short video. And I do hope to see you on my next video. Have a great day. Bye-bye.